And hello everybody, hope everybody's alright, hope everybody's looking after themselves and welcome back to Freedom Fighter. There's been reports and news out that the Halifax copper last year that choked somebody on Wall Street here in Halifax will not be facing criminal prosecution. But we'll show you now the following clip of the police officer choking uh, the person on Wally Road and the protest outside Halifax Police Station. This is just part one, guys. We are not going to uh, let this story slide. So let's have a look at the uh, following footage now. Ahmed hasn't been asked to come in to provide a statement against the officers. It's imperative that we get a statement as soon as possible, get these officers questioned for the manner in which they treated Mr. Hassan, and more importantly, see whether or not the officers are going to formally be investigated. It's about time this community spoke up. We've had enough as a community. Um, everyone's here in support of wanting answers from the superintendent. So, inshallah, uh, we're still waiting for the superintendent to come out. This needs to stop. It doesn't matter what colour lives are. It needs stopping right now before somebody else gets murdered. And we're here to support the protesters um, against the disgusting brutality that we saw in the video. Um, we know that there's is systematic racism that goes on in the police and we're here to say that we don't agree with that and that we think it needs to be tackled. I think everyone just out here today to protest police brutality. It was a, a total abuse of power um, and gross misconduct from the police officer involved um, in arresting a person, a suspect. Uh, when that suspect has clearly shown that he's not resisting um, to put someone in a chokehold and punch them in the face while they're on the ground it's just totally unacceptable and that's why everyone's out here today youngsters community we want justice and a sort of order what's happened and that we appeal to the police uh, commissioner to take this seriously and uh, give us a response so we can uh, guide our youngsters to on the uh, with the police to work together